Hey everyone, it's Cheryl from Teaching Two and Three Year Olds. We finished our farm theme. I hope you were able to see that video last week. Now we're moving on to pumpkins and this is the second half of October. I used to add pumpkins in with my apple theme. This year I decided to have it be separate because we have so many activities for each one. So we have a little fall coffee shop going on in our dramatic play area. We have magnetic pumpkins with other magnetic pieces on our light table. We have an itsy bitsy spider going down the water spout happening in our block area. We're painting pumpkins and we're painting spiders in our art area. We have all kinds of pumpkin stamps and pumpkin cookie cutters in our Play-Doh area. And then we have all kinds of different table activities with pumpkins and our highlight for circle time is our five little pumpkins jumping on a bed and this is a free printable that's over on, on my website i'll drop that link in the video's description so let me take you around the classroom so you can see how it's set up and i'll have some snippets of the children actually engaged in these centers as well on our light table we have our magnetic jingle bells and we've had these about six years maybe even longer and then we have our magnetic wands and we have our magnetiles In our dramatic play area, we have our fall coffee shop. These printables are in our pumpkin packet on Teachers Pay Teachers. And we have our coffee maker and we have some tea kettles and cups. And we also have some empty tea boxes that I have saved and I made them sturdier by wrapping them in, in some packing tape. And then we have sweets like donuts, pretend donuts and cookies and little dessert items, like a little bakery. How did all of our food get in the coffee maker? Mm. In our block area, it's Itsy Bitsy Spider. And we took a rain gutter that I got from Home Depot and I taped it to one of our see-through blocks and it's upright. And then I have small spiders that they can drop down the water spout. We have different pumpkin printable activities and I'll drop the links to all of those in this video's description. We also have some orange and black bristle blocks for some fine motor fun and then we'll also put out some puzzles. art activities that we will have for our first week with our pumpkin theme will be painting pumpkins and then a separate activity is taking those plastic spiders and they're going to paint them black and they can even make them walk around the white piece of paper that is underneath and you can find some other art activities that we will 
be choosing from in our pumpkin resource page. And this is a page I created that has ideas that we've done that are perfect for the pumpkin theme for all the different centers in your classroom. So make sure to check out that page. So today we are painting little pumpkins. And then I put a pumpkin printable underneath it. This is from our seasonal coloring packet. If they want to do some additional painting. In our writing area, we have our pumpkin left to right. And this is in our pumpkin packet on Teachers Pay Teachers. And then we also have our pumpkin tracing page. This will be for our three and four year olds and our pre-K will be using this as well. And this is in our tracing, our fall tracing packet. We will also have um, our Halloween color pages and also our pumpkin page. Again, all of the links to these are in this video's description. In our sensory bin, we have some dyed rice. I dyed it orange and then we have little those little party pumpkins that they can fill as well as some other little containers. Our Play-Doh area, I have these pumpkin placemats that I love to use for our pumpkin theme, and then we have pumpkin stamps and we have pumpkin cookie cutters. For circle time, we will be doing five little pumpkins jumping on a bed, and then I have some pumpkin props for the children to hold. We will be doing Itsy Bitsy Spider. Um, our older classes will be counting pumpkins from one to 10. All of this is in a separate video, our pumpkin circle time video, which will be out very, very shortly, if it's not already. Good morning, good morning, how are you? Good morning, good morning, how are you? It's such a special day, I'm glad you came to play. Good morning, good morning, how are you? Four little pumpkins jumping on the bed. One fell off and bumped his head. Mommy called the doctor and the doctor said, Jumping on the bed. One, two, three. Oh, can you make your pumpkin do twirls? This is a, this pumpkin really wants to jump and twirl. Three little pumpkins jumping on the bed. One fell off and bumped his head. Mommy called the doctor and the doctor said, No more pumpkins jumping on. So that's how we have our classroom set up for the pumpkin theme. If you like this video, please make sure to give it a thumbs up. And if you aren't already, please subscribe to Teaching Two and Three Year Olds on YouTube and click that bell icon so that every time I publish a new video, you'll be notified. Thanks for watching.